Hey guys, it's Shawnee here. Um, I know I don't usually use my voice for recordings, but I felt like it would go a lot faster for this tutorial. Um, and it's kind of long, so it could be a two-part, I'm not sure, but yeah. So this is one for how to download um, Photoshop CS5 for free. It's not extended. Um, if you want to extend it, I'm sure I can find that link, but I don't have that right now, so yeah. Um, what you're going to need for this is this link, which I will put in the, dis the, the sorry, description, and, um, WinRAR, which I can also put the download link to that. I already have WinRAR downloaded. It doesn't look like that, um, but I put a thing on there where it's pink, um, yeah, so I can find that for you too. And yeah, so once you get this link open, you're just going to want to click download and go through whatever. Um, also, some people said that they can't download RARs, like RAR files. I can't either, but I have this program called IsArt to down to convert it into a zip file um I said that on Facebook but I wasn't really thinking cause you don't need Isarc for this you just need WinRAR so yeah ugh it's not responding I'm gonna pause this and then when it starts to download I'll be back Okay, so it's finally letting me download it. Um, I have this little thing that pops up. I'm not sure what all that comes with. I have a Windows 7. Um, I don't know if that's different with like Vista and stuff. Um, but yeah, so you're just gonna want to save it though. And yeah, just let it download. And then for when it does um finish, you're just gonna want to open WinRAR. It just kind of already have it. Yeah. Okay, once it has downloaded, um, you should be able to find it in your downloads. It should say RS in cap locks, and then lowercase s, and then PS dot RAR. Um, you should be able to click that. And then it'll bring up this little dot thingy, and then um, Adobe Photoshop CS5. Just click that. And then it's gonna bring up like with like a thousand little things all over. Um, I can kind of show you. Really, the only thing I like is these presets, which comes with actions, brushes, um, like styles, a bunch of cool things. If you don't know what all of those are, I can make another video like a Photoshop basic. It took me like a month to kind of get the hang of it and then like a few days ago I finally made my first edit and I'm really proud of it to be honest. Uh, but yeah, so for the actual Photoscape, let's scroll all the way down to the P's and then find the one that says application or I guess you could just go by type and then application blah 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 photoshop and it'll be the biggest size of all of them obviously because it's the actual thing um and so yeah you're just gonna want to open it I don't know if I'm opening right now. I did like a bunch of things with it one time when I first got it. Um, you know, no, then all of a sudden it just opens. I don't really know what I did. So I don't know if it's going to open right now. I don't think it will. Um, and I don't know if you could hear that. There's like this screeching like sound and like coming from this window in my room. Then again, over by it is like a vent. I don't know what it is, but it's weird. But anyway, um, let's review. No, just mm, do 
need to do. I don't know. <laughs> um, but you can put this file on your desktop. Um, like this entire file. Um, I have it on my desktop, so that's how I'll open it. I am new, I do not want this. Yeah, yeah, hyper cam. Yeah, that's what I use to record my videos if you're wondering. Um, well actually I use this other website for my other ones, but now I'm starting to use hypercam. If this will load. Um oh I don't know, this seems kinda weird. Um Alright. As I said, this is gonna be a super duper long video. I think I'm actually gonna stop right now. I don't know where it is. But um yeah, I'm gonna stop it and then start part two and second. So yeah.